New listing, new listing, read all about it. Coming to you right now on Friday for showings on Saturday, open house right now, coming soon, right now, read it, read it. Why you should be marketing your home as coming soon. Hi, and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Samantha and I'm a local realtor in the North Atlanta market. Before I talk about all the benefits of coming soon and why you as a seller should be utilizing it, First, I just want to go over a brief definition of what that means or what a coming soon listing really is. If you think about movies and how they're marketed, you know, we have a movie release date and trailers and commercials and movie posters and teasers and everything comes out months, sometimes even a year or two before the movie actually gets released. If you recall, the end of the trailer usually says coming soon to a theater near you or coming soon with an actual release date. So the concept is exactly the same when it's applied to real estate. So essentially what somebody is doing is they're marketing a home or piece of property as for sale, but they're not actually allowing anybody to physically visit, see, or purchase the property until a specific date. So they're going to share some details about the house, maybe some information about the house specifically, beds, baths, square footage, sometimes about the price, sometimes photos, sometimes not. Um, but essentially they're gonna be teasing you with what's coming to the market soon. You might even see listings like this already in your market on public sites like Realtor and Zillow that say coming soon. And you pick up the phone and you call your Realtor and you say, hey, I gotta see this house, this is perfect. And your Realtor might say something like, well, this is coming soon. We can't actually visit or see or go to it until such and such date. That's a coming soon listing. Now let's talk about the three big ways this could benefit you as the home seller. Number one is marketing the home for sale, getting the word out, giving you a few extra days to get the home prepared for the market. You might notice in some coming soon listings that they only have an exterior photo or a front view of the home. Sometimes this might be on purpose. The homeowner might be utilizing a few extra days, whether it be a week or two weeks or whatever the coming soon listing is being advertised as, to get the home ready, maybe to clean up a few things, finish up the decluttering, organize it a closet or two, maybe even touch up some paint. So you as a seller, this could be a way to start getting the word out about your house and creating sort of that marketing buzz while giving you a few extra days to actually get the home ready. The second benefit of utilizing this marketing strategy, and I kind of teased it a little bit a moment ago, but this is creating a big marketing buzz around your home specifically. This is going to put all the buyers in your market that are looking for a home just like yours on alert that this home is about to become available. You might even notice a trend with coming soon, and a lot of agents will do this, is they will end the coming soon time period and allow showings to begin typically on a weekend and more specifically during an open house. And they do this on purpose. They want every potential buyer that is excited about your house to come to your house at the same time if they can control that, because that's gonna create quite a buzz around your house and create sort of an atmosphere of FOMO, a little bit of fear of missing out. And if all these buyers see that these other buyers are interested in it, it's gonna create sort of that you know, fear of missing out and that anticipation, and it could really help boost the amount of offers you receive on a home. And of course, based on what I've mentioned in other videos, and if you understand what's happening in the real estate market right now, in a seller's market, Market, multiple offers typically results in a higher sales price. Right now we're seeing sometimes as little as 5% and in some markets as high as 20% or more in terms of what the accepted offer is in relation to the actual list price. So the more offers we get on your home, the more money you net as the seller. And the third benefit of utilizing a coming soon listing is to actually sell your house faster than what's happening on the traditional market. In fact, a study done by Inman recently actually looked at a specific market and realized that coming soon homes actually sell at about 33% faster than homes that are not marketed as coming soon. So let me give you an example of what that looks like in terms of how long on the market. So in that particular MLS, properties that were not being sold or advertised as coming soon were selling in about 40 to 42 days on the market. And homes that were utilizing the coming soon marketing strategy were selling at about 27 or 28 days on market. Now, there, that may not seem like a whole big difference to you, 27 versus 42, but that really could be the difference on whether or not you have to make one whole extra mortgage payment before closing because one's less than a month and one is more than a month. So that could be a big difference in your market. 
Now, while this is looking at one specific market, I can tell you that this is a trend happening all over the country. I've been communicating with a lot of agents all over the country and they're all seeing the same thing. And coming soon, listings just sell faster. And statistics also show the faster you sell, the more money you net as a seller. So I suggest if you're sitting there as a homeowner and you're thinking about selling, that you meet with your real estate professional and you ask them whether or not you can utilize this coming soon marketing strategy. I will say that not every MLS will allow it. Not all every realtor board will allow it. There are rules around it. Some have a limit on how long you can actually market things as um, you know, coming soon or how they are allowed to be marketed as coming soon. So that could vary from market to market and area to area. So it's important to understand what the rules are in your area. However, if you can utilize this marketing strategy, then I 100% would suggest it. As always, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you found this information helpful. You know, I really enjoy making these videos for you and I really wanna make the content that you're looking for. So if you have an idea for a future video or a question or comment or concern, especially in today's crazy real estate market, please leave it in the comments section below. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you next week. Here, coming soon. Showing starts Sunday. Come see it. Come see it right now. Right now. <laughs>